Hey, what's up guys? Aiden here, and as you can see, yep, after, gosh, months probably, basically after a long time of uh, not being down here, I am back at my Halloween room. <sighs> Man, it's good to be back down here. Um, as you can see, there are um, a bunch of animatronics down here that um, need to be set up. And um, uh, yeah, of course you already have the animatronics already set up, like Teary and Rising Reaper of Death. But um, yeah, like I mean, there's so many animatronics I have down here that need to be set up, like... A uh, lurching zombie needs to be put back up. Um, Pumpkin Patch Prowler and Looming Straw Man. The Howler. And I'm, yeah. Just a lot of animatronics that need to be put back up. And, um, also, um, some, some of this stuff's been moved around. Um, reorganized since the last time I was here. Um... Yeah, so basically, today's Halloween room video, I'm just gonna mainly be setting up, um, Halloween animatronics. That's pretty much what I'm gonna be doing. So, I guess the first one I'll set up today is THD 3000. So, without further ado, let's get into the time lapse of me setting him up right now. Alrighty guys, so as you saw in the time lapse, here is THD all set up. And I gotta say, he looks so cool down here. Now, also in this um, Halloween room video, um, it, it, it won't be included, but um, I will also be getting demos of um, some of my other props that are down here that I don't have demos of yet on my channel um for instance like coat rack monster i don't have a demo of yet um twilight twitcher i don't have a demo of yet and then just some other animatronics like heckles and um uh i think uh faceless scarecrow um so yeah, I'm just going to be getting demos of those, so stay tuned for that. But um, I guess the next animatronic we will set up is... Let's take a look here. I guess will be the Jemmy Ghost Girl. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into her time lapse right now. <laughs> Alrighty, so as you saw, uh, Ghost Girl's setup was, like, really, really easy to do. Like, she she's a classic Jemmy item, so of course her setup isn't going to be hard at all to do. But, um, uh, yeah, um, maybe I'll get Shorty set up today as well. Um, I'm not sure. I guess we'll just see how everything goes. Um, over here is Heckles. Now, he was already all set up. Um, but I have him here because I will be doing a demo on him. And then, yeah, I moved THD right there. And then over here, here's Leatherface, um, who I bought, uh, last year. I bought Leatherface. Um, and then here's my Baphomet. Um, I, I went ahead and fixed his scythe because it was kind of all wonky and stuff. So I went ahead and fixed that, um. If I want to activate him, I'll have to move the riser off because, as you can see, his horns are hitting the ceiling tile up there. So I'll either have to move the ceiling tile to activate him or, like, lower him down to the um, main 
or the floor, but um, I'll figure something out to get him um, functioning on the riser. And then, again, there's Coat Rack Monster over there, who I plan on doing a demo on today as well. Um, so, yeah. Um, other than Ghost Girl, I guess we can get into the time lapse of putting together Shorty. So, let's get into that time lapse right now. Alrighty guys, so as you saw in the time lapse, I got Shorty all set up here. Now, in this box is Dark Countess and um, Mommy's Favorite. Um, I don't know if I'll get to setting them up today. Um, because, oh, and also I believe Betty Sharp is also in this box as well. I don't think I'll get to setting them up today as I want to get the Howler all set up. I want to get him set up as well today. So I think the last two animatronics I'll get set up today are the Howler. And then here is the base for Boogeyman. I want to get um, SVI's... Uh, Boogeyman from Home Depot set up today as well. So I think that will be the last two animatronics I will set up for today. So now, I guess without further ado, let's get into the time lapse of me setting up the Howler. Do the Mario swing your arms from side to side. Come on, it's time to go. Do the Mario. Take one step and then again, let's do the Mario. Alrighty guys, so as you saw in the time lapse, the Howler is a pretty easy setup. Um, it, I mean, it's classic techie. Um, I was trying to do a demo on him, but um, for some reason his adapter won't work. And for some reason right now he only works on batteries. And the batteries I had in him are dying. So um, the demo of him will have to wait until next time. But the last animatronic I'll be setting up today is the Home Depot Boogeyman, who is actually um, all in Possessed Pumpkin's box. And I will actually have to set him up in a different area due to the fact that the height of this ceiling I do not believe will fit him. So, yeah, um, I will see you guys in the other room, and then we will get into the time lapse of setting up the Home Depot 2023 Boogeyman. So, let's get into that right now. So I went ahead and finished setting up Boogeyman off camera because of how tall he is. Uh, but I did get a little bit of a time lapse of setting him up. So yeah, here he is all set up in all his glory. So like I said, this is the last animatronic I will be setting up today. And so today I got him set up. I got THD 3000 set up right over here. I got Shorty all put together, Ghost Girl, and the Howler. So yeah guys, that's pretty much everything that I did today. 
I hope you guys enjoyed um, this Halloween room video as it's been a while since I did one. Thanks for watching and bye.